What's up guys, Maniacs here, and welcome to There's Something in the Corner. Now, this game just came out today on Game Joe, and it actually looks kind of... Okay, calm down, Main Menu. Jesus. Alright, so what this game is about is it is a very, like, it's got kind of a cool style of graphics to it. It's a side-scrolling style adventure game, but it's a horror style to it, and apparently you play as this little girl, and what it looks like is they're like uh, chalkboard drawings is what the graphics look like, as you guys can kind of see on the main menu right here uh, with the, the lettering and everything, and it's by Blint Game... Bliant? I think it's Bliant Games. Now, this is the same developer that actually did the game that I played a long time ago, which was... Um, the epic quest of the evil jellyfish, I believe, is what the the whole title for it was. Which was it was it was kind of a stupid game, but it was actually kind of creative, and the writing was pretty funny. It was about where you had to be that jellyfish, and you went around and helped all those people, and that's where like the the dolphin with laser beam on his head, and like Vin Diesel was like I don't know, but you were trying to kidnap the princess, and you ended up helping her and everything. But regardless of that, I wanted to check this game out. It looks kind of cool. It's got a cool art style to it. I want to see what it's supposed to be, so it uh, recommends the headphones that are on, and you're supposed to just basically survive. And what I saw from the screenshot shots is it actually kind of has elements from like amnesia where you have to worry about your sanity and everything so i don't know how that's going to play into it but let's actually play it and see how long it is i haven't played this game so there is a power failure in your house find a way to fix it but be careful the darkness can play tricks on your mind so it is kind of like amnesia where like the monster could be there or it's not there okay so this is the game and this is what i was talking about it looks like um i don't know if anybody ever oh that's adorable what is that uh that helped my sanity ah uh, okay, w what the fuck was that? I have no idea what those things are that I'm picking up. It, it is cool though, I like the style of graphics, like, it's unique, I've never seen a game like this. Um, wh oh, those things, oh, she's getting scared, okay, I was like, what the fuck is happening? I don't know why I'm picking these things up, I don't know if I need them. Uh, I, I don't know what that is. Okay. So that thing moved. Okay, every time she jumps, uh, it's when, like, something happens. Okay. I don't know why I'm picking those. Oh, my God. The doors are so loud. And they close behind me. Okay, calm down. Uh, the, those pictures changed. Anybody else see that? All right, my sanity's starting to suck. I need to... Oh, there's a safe? Uh, oh, okay. So there's, uh, there's things that I need to find that have numbers on them, I'm guessing. So, what, what is... Okay, so the TV is five. Hold on, where's my pen? Ah, uh, come here. Come here, you fucker. So, the TV was, uh, number three. So, five. And, what? Well, calm down, stop freaking out. It was a lamp and, like, a tea kettle, okay? Uh, let's go find the tea kettle. The tea kettle was, uh, what, what was that? One, two, that's it? Two? Okay. So two, uh, there was a lamp somewhere. Where was that? Was that back in my room? Yeah, there it is. Okay, is that gonna, is that gonna do anything? Um, is, Okay, that was four. I I'm guessing here, but that's what those things look like. They remind me of the objects that I've seen around my house. I don't know if I actually need anything out of that safe or not. I don't know what it's going to actually get me. Um, but I need to hurry up because my sanity is only at 44%. So, and the last thing is, I don't know what that is. Is that a book or is that a painting? I guess I'll find out when I come across whatever it is. Oh, there's a kitty cat. Hi, kitty. Hi. Uh... Oh, 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 wow, she is, look at her face, she's freaking the fuck out, ah, alright, ah, uh, no, go away, um, so, can I just guess on the last number, I don't know what that is, I don't know, I don't have any, alright, so it's, um, four, two, five, oh, I got, I, ah, uh, ah, uh, fuck off, fuck off, hand, Alright, I've got very little time. Uh, I think the fuse box was right here. Uh, oh! That's only one... That's only one fuse? I only got one fuse. H how are you supposed to get the other ones? I'm about to die. H I, I, I... Oh, she's freaking the fuck out. That's actually kind of cool. And apparently I died. Okay, 
You drove yourself insane. Press okay. So I'm gonna go back to the main menu. I wanna actually beat this game. It's kinda cool. Um, I don't know if anybody ever played I I have no idea what the hell they were called. But when I was in like elementary school, there were these little black boards that our art teacher gave us. And if you like it was like taking uh if anybody's ever gotten like a code out of like a video game or something like that and you have to scratch off the back of that that stupid layer of like gray stuff so people can't just look at the code and steal it you have to scratch it off with like a like a coin or something like that there were these black boards that we could get when we were um uh when we were in elementary school and if you you uh like basically if you race stuff on them it would reveal you could like reveal a picture or you could actually draw your own picture with them as well like sometimes there would be like a rainbow underneath it or something like that i don't know it was a really long time ago but that's what kind of what these graphics remind me of okay so i only got one of the fuses how many fuses are there i don't know I, there's no other oh the r is to restart okay that that would have been nice to know before i accidentally did that so there's nothing with the space bar there's nothing with shift there's nothing there's no jumping or anything like that Oh, there's another fuse. Okay. Okay. Apparently they can be sitting in random spots like that. I didn't know that actually. All right. Now I really need to spam everything. I got... Oh. Wh where the hell did that come from? Okay. That was a random ass fuse. I don't know where that spawned up from. Okay. So I need to find one more of those little ghost things. If I can find one more, I think I'll get a fuse. Oh, I found it! Oh! Oh! Can I have that? Oh my god! Oh my god, I'm about to I, I actually got it! Okay, there was one in the picture. I don't know if I actually was able to see it because I was just spamming. But I think I got them all, right? Boosh! I got the lights on! Woo! I did it! Well done! You restored power. You can go to bed quietly now. Alright, that was actually a pretty cool game. That was pretty creative. So, I found all of the fuses. Um, it wasn't too bad. One of them, you had to find ten of those little ghost things, which nine of them are pretty easy. That last one was kind of hard to find. Um, another one was, excuse me, another one was behind the plate. Uh, there was another one where I had to, actually, you know what, I'll show you because I can do it really fast. Because it will just be easier to show you guys. So, there's one. Um, there's another one. And then, there's another one. And let's walk in here. Another one. Yeah, I'm working on it, dude. I got four. Relax. It'll be okay. Come on. Alright, open that. Give me that fuse. That thing right there. So, there's these little things. It looks like a... Oh, I gotta grab that. It looks like um, if somebody wrote something on the board, like a chalkboard with uh, with chalk or whatever, and then they erased it, there's that little powdery residue left. I gotta grab that one, that one. I don't know if these actually spawn, because that one wasn't there until I actually grabbed the one here in the kitchen. So, I got the one in the kitchen, which was right here. Oh, there's another one of those. I went back to the bedroom. I got the one that was in the bedroom. And then, let me grab this while I'm here. Four, uh, two, five, one. Got that one. Uh, there's that. And there's another one right there. Uh, da, 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 da. Where was it? Where's the last chalk thing is in here. There's that. And there's the last one. Boosh! There's the fuse. Grab that ghost guy. That big, that cool ghost is actually going to come and give me a fuse. He's going to vanish. Now I've got all four of the fuses. I can go back and uh, finish the game. There's only four fuses you got to get. So the reason I started this over, I know it only took me like a minute, but I wanted to show you guys how I got all of them. Um, I probably cut out everything, but I actually finally got the last one. Put all of them in there, and the lights come on. I actually got it. So that was a cool game. Developers, good job. I, I liked it. It was very... It, the graphic style was unique. It was kind of uh, kind of standard where I just find the fuses and get to it. Once I actually figured out where everything was, it was actually very quick. I mean, I literally just beat that in a minute. So it's not a very long game, but trying to get to the end was, it was fun. Like, I like the fact that your girl gets more and more crazy looking as her insanity goes down. That was kind of a cool, uh, that was kind of a cool, that was kind of cool. Um, honestly, I like the style of graphics though. I would like to see the developers make something else in this style. I thought it was kind of cool. I've never played a game that's like chalkboard style, and that's what this reminds me of. It looks like somebody drew this out in chalkboard. So, anyway, this was a pretty cool game. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you guys want to check the game out for yourself, there'll be a link to the game in the description below. Feel free to check it out. Um, now tomorrow, which is going to be Friday, October 6th, um, yeah, it's the day that Black Ops 3 comes out and everything. 
I, uh, I actually have to go to dinner with my mom because it's her birthday. Um, so I'm going to try and record an episode before I go, and then I'm going to have to come home late and edit and record all, all that stuff. So um, the episode tomorrow is going to go up super late, and I apologize for that. Um, also, there probably won't be another extra episode uh, on Saturday morning, which I know I haven't done two episodes in the weekends in the past two weeks. I apologize for that, but um, I actually have to work Saturday morning too, which blows even harder. Uh, I don't want to, but especially with Call of Duty out because I want to come home and play it. I'm so psyched for zombies. So what I might do is I actually might, um, because I I got the big collector's edition thing. I know I'm a loser. I'm sorry, um, but I might actually just jump on and play some of the giant map, which is the Durees map uh, from World at War. It's pretty much a remake for Black Ops 3. I might just jump on and play play that for a video on Saturday. If that's something you guys are interested in, let me know. Um, otherwise, I'll find another uh, another indie game. So anyway, that's all the time I got for you today, guys. Let me know what you guys think of this game in the comment section below. Developers, nice job. Look forward to seeing what you come up with. And thank you, everybody, so much for watching. Make sure to check out some of the other videos that I've done, and I will see you guys next time. Maniacs, out. What Was that me? Was that my shadow? Okay, I think I might have clipped into the object in front of me. Does the dolphin want the lasers? Sure, let's try that. Eee, thank you. Oh, it's it's Russian.